So yesterday, I typed up this whole message, okay? Because the Spirit of the Lord was speaking to me yesterday. And I believed I was supposed to post that message yesterday. So I typed up this whole paragraph, or maybe two. And when I went to post it, it delete. Listen, I let that happen to me today. So I, I type it. I'm doing a video. So I began to see a couple of years ago, um, probably around 2016, 20, 2015, 2016 or so, I began to have this vision. And in the vision, it was just like a sword, right? Like just a sword in my vision. And the sword was a flaming sword. And I was like asking people like, what does this mean? You know, because I just have this vision out of nowhere, you know? And so yesterday, the Holy Spirit brought that vision to my memory. And I was like, okay, what is this? So I believe the Spirit of the Lord was telling me yesterday that there is going to be a divide. Like he is bringing the sword to the body of Christ as we know it, right? But this divide is going to separate um, kingdom citizens, right, from the kingdom citizens, from the religious citizens, right, from this religious spirit. Um, the church as we know it, we're going to be seeing um, two sides, right? But here is the thing, because there are going to be a lot of people that you didn't expect um, to face, to have the face off, you know, the side A is supposed to be a believer, side B is supposed to be a believer. So what side do we choose? Lord, like what's going on here? Let me tell you something. This is going to be so much more important to understand the word of God. Because the people who are not for of for the Lord, we're going to be seeing them come against the word of God. And so as we see people of the, the kingdom, the kingdom citizens are going to be defending the word of God, the will of God, the heart of God. And this, separate is, this separation is going to draw a line between the two. Because let me tell you something. Um, the Bible talks about uh, those that have a form of godliness, but denying the power thereof. And we're going to see the kingdom citizens being separated from those that have a form of godliness, but de de um, denying the power thereof. The, denying the power thereof. So wh what are you supposed to do in this time and this season? You got to be prayerful. You got to be prayerful, especially when you see people or, or two, what we believe, supposed to be believers, when we see them coming at each other. We have to ask ourselves, Lord, what, 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 what do we do? Because I, you know, in the body of Christ, you know how we go, we have our favorite people, but your favorite person may not be the right person. Your favorite person may be on the wrong side of the gospel of the wrong side of the line. So this this sword that I was seeing, it's a it's a it's I believe the sword was, is representing the word of God, but the word of God is coming to divide the church as we know it. We're gonna see the, the, the people of the kingdom and the people that have a form of godliness but denying the power thereof. So listen to y'all gonna be careful out here in these streets. You gotta be prayerful and you gotta stay in your word so you don't be deceived and you end up on the wrong side of the tracks.